everybody, this is Napa Fan here, and this is race number five in season number one of the Menard Super Truck Series. We are here at the Chicago Land Speedway for a 12 lap race around our first intermediate track of the season here at the Chicago Land Speedway, one and a half miles long, and uh, three, including this one, three of the next four races will be at one and a half mile tracks, and they're pretty good. I think they work uh, very well in their 2003, and that's why I use them. Uh, quite frequently in my energy 2003 leagues. But anyways, let's get to the starting lineup here for this race. Jordy Newman on the pole. Alongside him, it's Zachary Fitzwater. Dean Wickard, who almost won. I almost said he was the last winner, but he's not the last winner. Uh, he came in second at IRP last time here in the Menard Super Truck Series. But uh, he barely lost that race there at IRP. I almost said that he was a winner of that race. I'm sorry about that. Nicholas Samadio in the 62. Cameron Gaju, Julian Quintero, Marty Johnson, Piper Acovedo, Davey Johnson, who won the last race here in the Menard Super Truck Series, Nick Smith, John Andrews, Cameron Black, Philip Goldberg, and Nicholas Gratton. That's the full field starting here at the Chicago Lamb Speedway for 12 laps of action. And uh, these trucks will start to roll off, make sure everybody's going okay, and they are. So we're good to go here at Chicagoland. So we are now halfway through the season here in the Menard Super Truck Series. And, yeah. <laughs> what else is there to say? We're halfway through the points leader... Heading into this race, I think might be Davy Johnson, but I'm not entirely sure. It's been a while since I've seen the points. But anyways, here we go. We're racing here at Chicagoland. Dean Wickard pushing the 78 to the lead. And Jordan Newman out front for now. Down the backstretch they go for the first time. Wicker's going to get stuck on the high lane, and they're going three wide in the 79. Zachary Fitzwater got popped out of line. He's falling back in that truck. They're all over the place, but Jordan Newman starting to pull away. Marty Johnson has found himself up to second place. They're going three wide there. They were going three wide, but fortunately they're not anymore. When they go three wide here at Chicago Land, lots of times it does not work. Here comes Marty Johnson in the 81, looking to the inside of Jordan Newman. He's kind of running him up the racetrack there. The 81, going to get a run to the inside of Jordan Newman. Newman's going to lead that lap, but Marty Johnson has the advantage, heading in the one. Here comes Julian Quintero in the 16, helping the 81 get past the 78. Here comes our last winner, Marty, or sorry, Davey Johnson. Wrong Johnson. And the number 87 won that exciting race at IRP. There he goes, three wide for the lead underneath of Quintero and Marty Johnson. But it's going to be Julian Quintero who leads lap number three here at Chicagoland. Davey Johnson is going to have the inside lane heading into turn one. Here comes Cameron Black in the 32. He's to the inside of Jordan Newman. And now Julian Quintero for second. I just remembered the points leader of this series is Cameron Gaju in the 57, who's right now running in last place. We may end up with a crash here if we're not careful. But they seem to be going okay for now. Davey Johnson trying to make it two in a row here in the Menard Super Truck Series. He leads lap number four. Here comes Cameron Black in the 32 to the inside of him for the lead. We have Jordan Newman still up here and Dean Wickard. Trying to get some redemption from that race he lost at IRP. See Cameron Black kind of working a middle lane there to get a really good run off the corner. Got a pretty big pack back here. They're going three wide and all that. They may almost go four wide. But they're not. They're still going to go three wide. However, we might want to watch this to make sure it's okay for these guys. Marty Johnson was at one point up front, but now he's falling to the back of the field. John Andrews is back here. Nick Smith, the Daytona winner, is back here. And they're going to go four wide with Cameron Black, Dean Wicker, Davey Johnson, and Jordan Newman. 
Well, they didn't go four wide, but they came really close. This is good news for Cameron Black in the 32. He's starting to pull away with all these guys going three wide for second. Dean Wickard in the middle here. Cameron, or Philip Goldberg, I should say, on the inside. The outside is Davey Johnson and Cameron Gaju. He was in last place at one point, but he's going to crash. There's a big crash through the tri-oval, and it is involving Davey Johnson, Nicholas Samadio, Piper Acovedo. It looks like Julian Quintero was involved, and so was Cameron Gaju in the 57. Just like that. I'm not sure if we're going to get back to racing or not. I hope we are. It's... Hopefully we do. I really want to finish this thing under green. Come on. <laughs> but it happened behind Cameron Gaju here. Just barely behind Cameron Gaju. The 78 of Jordan Newman. It was actually Davey Johnson in the 87 getting into the wall on the outside. He comes down, Newman was there, and into Gaju, and let's have some fun. Zachary Fitzwater was able to avoid that, so was the John Deere car of Nicholas Grattan. Does Nicholas Sambadio also drive a John Deere car? No, he's O'Reilly. <laughs> I'm really not car. Why am I calling them cars? They're trucks. I'm not really acquainted too well with this car set, so it's kind of hard to tell you know, what the sponsors are. I don't remember. As you see, the 57 into the wall hard. Car went airborne a little bit there. That's a tough break for our points leader, who might not be our points leader exiting this race. Our last winner, Davey Johnson, was involved. He was the one who started it all. We're going to go on board with him and see how it felt for the number 87. Five truck incident through the tri oval involving Davey Johnson, Julian Quintero, Cameron Gaju, Nicholas Samadio, and Piper Acovedo. It's a tough break for those guys. And I don't know if we're going to get back to racing or not. Cameron Black is the leader in the number 32. Dean Wickard looks like he might get another second place finish, but we're just going to have to see. I won't skip through all this because I'm not sure if we're going to be able to get back to racing or not. We are under caution here on lap 8 of 12. And please don't tell me these guys are coming into the pit road. Okay, they're not. I don't have the pit stops turned on here for this one. Anyways, let's uh, accelerate through all this and see. The lights would have to go out on lap 11, which is actually very possible. I think we probably will end up with a one-lap dash here. Lights are still on the pace truck. We're on lap 10 or 12. If they go out this time, we will be racing once again. And they do go out, so we're going to have a one-lap dash here at Chicagoland. That's great. So here we go. It's going to be Cameron Black, Dean Wickard, Philip Goldberg, Marty Johnson has found his way back to fourth place. He was in the lead, fell back, then came back up front in that number 81. Jordan Newman... John Andrews, Nicholas Grattan, Nick Smith, Cameron Gaju, Nicholas Samadio, Davey Johnson, Zachary Fitzwater, and Piper Acovedo. Uh, does appear that the only guy not on the racetrack right now is Julian Quintero in the number 16. Pace truck has pulled off. It's going to be one lap to go here at Chicago Land in the Menard Super Truck Series. Who's going to win it? Cameron Black with the advantage here. Dean Wickard in the 17. Fell back a little bit, but he can definitely get a draft down the back stretch. Here comes Marty Johnson in the 81 trying to get some positions. But it's looking pretty good for Cameron Black right now. They're three wide for third. Dean Wickard is the only guy that can get to this 32, and he might get to him. Here comes Wickard to the inside of Cameron Black. And at the line, it's going to be Cameron Black in the 32. That was close. Dean Wickard, if he tried to get to the inside just a little earlier, he might have been able to do it. But Cameron Black's going to get the victory here at Chicagoland in the Menard Super Truck Series. Take a look at that finish once again. It was pretty darn close. Let me just 
just get to it here and right. That's a stupid angle. This is a stupid angle too. <laughs> There's no real good angles at the finish line of this racetrack, but uh, you can see a good angle here is the helicopter. Use this one to kind of see. But uh, right there, that is the advantage that Cameron Black had on Dean Wickard at the line in the finish of this race. Great finish here at the Chicago Land Speedway. And Cameron Black is the winner in the number 32. <coughs> Take a look at the rest of the results right here. Dean Wicker, Jordan Newman, Marty Johnson, and Nicholas Grattan round out the top five. Philip Goldberg, John Andrews, Nick Smith, Nicholas Samadio, Davey Johnson, Piper Acovedo, Zachary Fitzwater, Cameron Gaggi, who was the points leader heading into this race, and Julian Quintero. That's the full field finishing results here at Chicagoland, and it's going to be very interesting to see how these point standings go. We only have three races left in the season. It's going to be a little while, might be about a, it's going to be more than a week before we get to the next race here in the Menard Super Truck Series. It's going to take a little bit of a break. Uh, we're going to have a lot of modified and uh, ARCA races in between, but uh, still we'll get right back to racing. I think the next race is Kentucky, and it's the good Kentucky. I found a good Kentucky. Yes, there is one in NR2003, and uh, we should see some passing in, the, in that race. Uh, so, yeah, that should be a good one. Then it's New Smyrna, and then the finale at the Kansas Speedway here in the Menard Super Truck Series. So, three races left, and you're going to see the points right now. So, congratulations to Cameron Black for winning. Thank you guys very much for watching, and here are the points for the Menard Super Truck Series. I will see you guys later.